Well, hey there, good morning, Proniacs. Welcome to this edition of Proni Mornings. And it is Thursday morning, so I usually have a really hard workout. Today is no exception. I have a hour and 50 minute run, which I take a couple breaks during because I find that if I take a one to two minute walk or slow break that I can pick up my pace a lot faster. So if I'm running, let's say three miles at a half uh, a minute pace faster, I can make up those minute and a half and feel a whole lot better than just slogging it along. So the further I go at four or five miles, then I start gaining on my time. So that's what I kind of train myself to do, especially in these half marathons and marathon runs what at the end of you know the swim and then the bike so i am preparing for chelan man which is going to be not this weekend but next weekend we leave next thursday getting really excited about it and so is lydia she's got the splash and dash on that sunday and she's super excited about her race so we'll see how that goes and i'm sure i'll update you and probably take some video and share it here on pernoia mornings I wanted to share with you today a message that I found very uh, hmm, useful, I guess you'd say yesterday, that uh, when you have negative images, and I know that if you're a big visualizer like I am, where you meditate and then you visualize, sometimes you get these negative images that pop into your mind, or these negative thoughts that turn into images that you wish you wouldn't see. So maybe you feel uncomfortable about it, maybe you feel embarrassed that you actually think it, but you're human and these are the things that kind of happen to you <coughs> because you're in this world. You don't have to be of this world, but you have to live in this world. So these negative thoughts are going to come and you gotta know what to do with them. What do you do with these negative images that you close your eyes and that you could see that you don't want to see or remember? Well, I'll tell you, I learned a really cool uh, strategy in order to get rid of these and what you do is you see the image and then you draw a circle around it in your mind and then you put two X's inside of it and then throw it out into the universe like a frisbee I have to give credit to UR creators by YouTube I watched their videos and this is what gave me the idea to share with you guys on Pernoia mornings so what you do is once you see that negative image you see it in your mind, you draw a circle around it, you put two X's inside of it, and then you throw it out into the universe like a Frisbee. So if you're able to do this, then I wouldn't say try to visualize it again, but if you see that again, if you see that image again, the negative image that you don't want to see any longer, do that two more times, and then it should be gone from your consciousness forever, and your subconscious. So this is the power of the mind and how you can determine what comes in and out of your mind by filtering out or getting rid of the things that don't serve you or that you're unhappy to have visualizing in your in your mind. So I hope this helps you today. I know that it's gonna help me with this strategy because of things, there are certain things that come up that are unpleasant or maybe negative or that I don't want to see in my head, but sometimes I do, even if that's something on the news where I visualize something that happened where somebody was kidnapped or all these different tragedies that happened. If I don't want those in my mind anymore, I can just go ahead and visualize it, circle it, two X's through it, and throw it out in the universe like a Frisbee, and it shouldn't be in your mind anymore. So I'm gonna see how this works for me, see how it works for you, and I hope this helps you get through to be your better self. It's not what we say or do, but the way we make you feel that you're going to remember. Thank you.